Welcome to the Graham School of Continuing Liberal and Professional Studies at the University of Chicago. The Graham School is home to many different types of programs at the university, ranging from non-credit courses in the liberal arts, to international study tours, certificate programs in business, and programs which confer academic credit. The Graduate Student at Large, or GSAL program, can be taken on a full-time basis and qualifies international applicants for student visas to study in the U.S. Nearly 20% of all GSAL students are international. GSAL enables qualified applicants to enroll in regular university courses at the University of Chicago at either the undergraduate or graduate level for full academic credit and grades. GSAL opens the doors of a world-class university to students from around the world without requiring matriculation to a degree program. The University of Chicago faculty are celebrated for their commitment to scholarship of the highest caliber, and students here can expect to learn from academic leaders in their disciplines, from economics to biology, urban sociology to classics. Eight current members of the faculty number among the university's 87 Nobel Prize winners. The University of Chicago has long recognized the important role played by the global exchange of ideas, scholarship, and culture. Intellectual exchange across international boundaries has been a core value of the university, and our history of collaboration with Chinese scholars reaches back to the early 1900s. The University Center in Beijing is located on the 20th floor of the Culture Plaza in the Haidian district of Beijing, conveniently situated to Peking University, Renmin University of China, and Tsinghua University. Since opening in 2012, the center has anchored the university's growing engagement with Chinese scholars and institutions. Some of the events since the, since the center's inauguration have included an international conference on China and the Great Recession, an international symposium on longitudinal survey methods for human capital, a conference on novel quantum states in condensed matter, and the first Chinese political sociology workshop in partnership with the Department of Sociology of Renmin University. William Rainey Harper, the first president of the University of Chicago, led an ambitious faculty committed to excellence in scholarship and teaching. Women were admitted as students from the very beginning, marking the young university as a leader in independent thinking. Robert Hutchins, the fifth president, continued the university's innovative paths in higher education with his emphasis on the development of a truly interdisciplinary curriculum and the central role of original texts and small seminars devoted to rigorous analysis and critical thinking. The University of Chicago is located in Hyde Park, a residential neighborhood about seven miles south of The Loop, the historic commercial center of downtown Chicago. Hyde Park is situated on the lakefront of Lake Michigan and was the site of the 1893 World's Columbian Exposition. Hyde Park also hosts the city's Museum of Science and Industry and architect Frank Lloyd Wright's Roby House, both destination points for Chicago. The University of Chicago campus brings together an impressive array of neo-Gothic architecture and stunning modern buildings like the Joe Enrica Mansueto Library, pictured here. Designed by Helmut Jahn and formally dedicated in October 2011, the newest library on the campus houses a state-of-the-art high-density automated storage and retrieval system to give scholars and researchers access to requested material within minutes. The soaring glass dome of the Grand Reading Room provides light, space, and air for scholars working with the library's digital and print collections. The Gleacher Center, located in downtown Chicago, 15 minutes from Hyde Park by the Metro Electric Train, offers students accepted to the Graduate Student at Large program the opportunity to take courses alongside Chicago Booth evening and weekend MBA students. GSAL students interested in business can choose to take either day or evening and weekend courses at the Chicago Booth School of Business. Booth courses offered during the day are housed in the Harper Center on the main university campus in Hyde Park. Chicago is the third largest city in the United States, situated on Lake Michigan and an international center of commerce, finance, and industry. Chicago has the fourth largest metropolitan GDP in the world, after Tokyo, New York, and Los Angeles. It is home to two major league baseball teams, the White Sox and the ill-starred Chicago Cubs, who last won the World Series in 1908, leaving them with a longer World Series drought than any other team in Major League Baseball. Chicago claims a place of cultural prominence in American music and theater. 
where blues, jazz, and improv and ensemble theater all developed. Chicago is known as the City of Neighborhoods, where a visitor today can explore many different ethnic communities. Greek Town, the Ukrainian Village, Little Italy, the Indian and Pakistani businesses lining Devon Avenue, Irish and Scottish pubs all offer a glimpse of immigrants now settled in the city. Chinatown is one of the more robust ethnic neighborhoods and located just 15 minutes north of the university campus by car. Millennium Park, inaugurated in 2004, provides a space for art, music, and architecture to come together in the heart of the city. Chicagoans and visitors to the city come to Millennium Park to play, unwind, and experience a world-class city. The American poet Carl Sandburg described Chicago as the city of big shoulders. The sight of the city's muscular skyscrapers confirms the poet's vision. Pictured here, alongside the Chicago River, is the celebrated Wrigley Building, with the glassy Trump Tower in the background and the Willis Tower, formerly the Sears Tower, in the distant background. Chicago is celebrated both for its architecture and its sense of play. Both come together here in the whimsical, sensuous curves and polished surface of the bean in Millennium Park. The GSAL program is open to applicants who have already earned their BA, BS, or equivalent. Applicants who are accepted into the program are then eligible to enroll in University of Chicago courses at both the graduate and undergraduate level. They receive academic credit and earn grades for their coursework, which are recorded on formal University of Chicago transcripts. The GSAL program is highly flexible, offering students the opportunity to register for courses across the entire university landscape, with the exception of the Pritzker School of Medicine. The only curricular requirement is that students possess the necessary academic qualifications or experience for their requested courses. GSAL admission staff work closely with departmental liaisons to determine course fit and provide curricular guidance. This flexibility makes GSAL an excellent program for international students in particular who may lack familiarity with U.S. academic disciplinary boundaries or who want to explore multiple academic fields or subdisciplines. Students in the GSAL program have access to all of the university's professional schools and academic divisions, with the exception of the Pritzker School of Medicine. GSAL students attend regular university courses alongside University of Chicago graduate and undergraduate students taught by University of Chicago faculty. This level of integration and access is one of the distinctive hallmarks of the program. International applicants are increasingly turning to GSAL as a means to study abroad for a quarter or longer. While here, they can conduct research and take courses with leading faculty in their fields. In the past year, GSAL has been home to one DAAD scholar, two Fulbright scholars, and multiple international students pursuing PhDs and master's degrees. GSAL offers international students the opportunity to spend time on campus, take courses with leading scholars, and access the university's world-class research collections in the sciences, social sciences, and humanities. Within the main GSAL program, two new certificate programs have recently been developed. The Postgraduate Certificate in Medical Physics was designed collaboratively with the faculty in the Committee on Medical Physics to facilitate professional development for physicists seeking to enter the field of medical physics. A PhD in physics from either Canadian or U.S. universities is required to apply for this one-year program. The Postgraduate Certificate in Quantitative Methods in the Social and Behavioral Sciences was developed to provide applied skills and formal knowledge in theory and methodology, data analysis, and survey research. Applicants must have a BA or equivalent. GSAL students have access to five of the university's six professional schools and a range of departments within the four academic divisions, biological sciences, humanities, physical sciences, and the social sciences. Qualified students are eligible to register for courses in the Chicago Booth School of Business. GSAL students are free to choose from courses offered either in Booth's full-time or evening and weekend MBA programs. The Graduate Student at Large program practices rolling admissions. Applications may be submitted for any one of the four university quarters, autumn, winter, spring, or summer. 
applicants are typically notified of their admissions decision within several weeks. The two postgraduate certificate programs are currently only admitting students starting in the autumn quarter. For the academic year 2012-13, the total in GSAL tuition and fees to enroll in classes full-time for one quarter, not at the Chicago Booth School of Business, is $8,200. Books and other course materials, living expenses, and accommodation will typically add an additional $3,000 to $3,500 for the average student. Graduate students at large enjoy access to most university resources, including privileges at all campus libraries, athletic facilities, online services, and student health care and counseling. Campus meal plans and accommodation at the International House are also available. Applications are accepted for each of the four academic quarters, although students are currently admitted to the postgraduate certificate programs in medical physics and quantitative methods only for the autumn quarter. The Graham School's Graduate Student at Large program affords unparalleled access to the University of Chicago for international students. Our staff welcomes you and your questions about the program. Learn more and apply to begin your experience at the University of Chicago. Emphatically, yes.